Hello there, how are you doing? My name is Joe Barnes and I'd like to welcome you to the official Social Networking Academy blog. Now many of you watching this will already know who I am and I would like to take this moment to say hello to the SNA community and to all of the people who frequent the fan page. For some of you though, you may be thinking, who is this chick? So I'd just like to spend a couple of seconds introducing myself to you. My name is Joe Barnes, as I said. I have been marketing on Facebook and teaching others to use social media for about 18 months now, and I love it. Um, in April 2011, we launched our Social Networking Academy site, which is a membership site, and uh, we have just over 1,200 members. And I'm very humbled and honored to say that I have helped probably a few thousand people now build fantastic fan pages for themselves, their clients, and help them get their businesses off the ground. So that's just just a little bit about my business. Um, I travel, we love traveling. We actually set our business up in order to, so that we could travel. I'm currently in Thailand, I'm in Phuket. I have a five-year-old daughter who started school here today, so that's very exciting. And myself and my partner work together on the business. So, um, what's the blog about? It is to give you loads of information about what is happening in social media. It's also to, to share with you the trials and tribulations of running a business online um, and to kind of open the doors and demystify the process a little bit for you and show you that it isn't all glamour. There's a lot of hard work and blood, sweat and tears behind it. So, I'm going to leave it there. Um, all the posts will speak for themselves. Do come back regularly. In the meantime, I am going to show you a really quick business trick, okay? It's a little something that you can use, A, to be able to see my blog posts very regularly, but also to get all of your favorite blog posts and updates at the click of a button every single day so that you can stay up to date and ahead of the game with what's happening in your industry. So keep watching. It's going to take just a couple of minutes to show you this fantastic little tool, and I look forward to speaking to you again very, very soon. You have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye. Okay then, guys. So what I'd like you to do is come over to my blog, which of course course you're currently on now because you're uh, watching this little video of mine and up here on the top right you'll see this little purple icon which is to subscribe to our feed okay now if you actually click on that icon that's then going to take you to another screen and it's going to ask you to add my blog to your reader okay now for those of you who already have readers you may have readers then it comes up with all these different readers plus you have this drop down box to add it to any reader you've got if you do not have a reader I'm going to very quickly show you what one is I'm going to set up the Google reader for you okay and that's what I use and all you do is you'd simply click plus here on the Google icon once you've done this and that will then go and add that to your Google reader Okay, you can actually add it to your Google homepage as well. So it could show on your main homepage or you could add it to your Google Reader. Okay, so what is a Google Reader? If I just pop over to Google right now um, and all you have to do is type in google.com or google.co.uk and then up here in the black bar at the top, you've got more. If you click on more and just click on Reader, okay that's then going to open the reader for you now all you need to have a reader is an email address a gmail address okay so of course you need to go and set yourself up a gmail.com account um, and I'll let you guys do that and then you simply click sign in okay and there's your Google reader now mine is absolutely chock-a-block because I've already got lots and lots of different blogs that I uh, I look at on a daily basis um, yours of course may be completely empty it will be completely empty the first time you do this and then all you have to do as I said is from the blog you click on that little purple button let's head back to the actual blog and I'll show you again you click on that purple button as soon as you set up your reader um, and then it's going to take you to this page if you get that subscribe with Google, just reset the favorites, show your subscribe options, click on Google there, okay, and then add to Google Reader. Just click on that and that's going to automatically add my blog to your Google Reader so then on a daily basis you can see the posts. And of course you can go and do that for all sorts of websites. So any website out there that has that little RSS icon, you can click on that, add it to your Google Reader and then it's going to be in here. Okay, so you can go through and, and keep up to date with all of your favorite blogs on a daily basis. If you don't find the RSS reader, then all you simply do is come in here to your Google Reader, click subscribe and put in the URL of the website. Most websites and blogs now have got it set so that all you literally need to do is put in the URL and it will automatically give you their feed. 
If they don't have it set, then just uh, enter their URL and put in a forward slash and feed on the end, F W -E D, and that would normally work as well. Okay, and if that doesn't work and you really want to get their updates, then just get in touch with them and say, hey, I need your RSS address. All right, I hope that that's been useful to you. Thank you very much for uh, popping along today to our blog, and, uh, and I look forward to seeing you again very, very soon. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a great day. Speak soon. Bye-bye.